Do you know about the drug that causes more overdose deaths than any other? It's a drug that's up to 100 times stronger than morphine, and its original use was for pain management for cancer patients. The drug is called fentanyl, and it's a synthetic opioid that targets the parts of your brain that deal with both pleasure and pain. It's often mixed with heroin, cocaine, and methamphetamines, and it can be made into pills that also resemble other prescription opioids. The scary part? There is no way to visibly know if a substance contains fentanyl or not. Just a tiny bit of fentanyl, like two milligrams, can result in an overdose death. Basically, it's made illegal drugs like Russian roulette resulting in overdose. Since fentanyl kills about 136 people every day, you may be wondering why are dealers mixing it with heroin, cocaine, meth, or prescription opioids if it keeps killing their customers? Because fentanyl is so strong, it's even more addictive. It creates intense euphoric and relaxing effects that makes other drug highs seem basic in comparison. Once used, everyday life feels numb, like you can't feel anything at all. And the coming down from fentanyl is brutal, triggering intense body pain, diarrhea, and severe cravings for the drug. But now, the basic drug won't cut it, and it takes more and more fentanyl to feel its effects. So even though a whole bunch of people are dying every single day, the ease and intensity of the addiction keep people coming back outpacing the loss of those who die from an overdose. Treatment for fentanyl addiction is intense because the drug is so powerful. You need a biopsychosocial approach. Biologically, most people need some kind of medication-assisted treatment to cope with the withdrawal and deal with the cravings. Psychologically, you need individual, group, and maybe family-based therapy using evidence-based treatment to address the underlying why behind using in the first place. And socially, you need support finding sober friends and community and or getting a job and managing school. For most addiction and mental health challenges, but especially with fentanyl, you need a biopsychosocial approach. If you want to learn more about fentanyl addiction specifically designed for teens and young adults, then go to sandstonecare.com or call the number in the description box below. We'll get to know you and your specific situation and connect you with the support that you need, even if it's not with us. Change is possible, and Sandstone Care is here to help.